Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Spyro 3. We are currently on Lost Fleet. This is episode two, part two, if you will. Uh, we're currently going to do the submarine level, bonus level, which is right here. These here waters used to be my favorite diving spot, but I can't get any loot with these subs patrolling around. Think you can pilot this here sub I bought for scrap? <laughs> you sure? Alrighty then. Press the jump button to speed on up. And when you get a sub in your sights, the torpedo will start to lock on. If you get a good lock on, fire away with the attack button. Circle button, yeah. So this is, uh, this world has, I, I said this last episode, this world is probably my favorite bonus levels. I would always, always, would always come in here in this bonus level and, um, man, I was just coming here to shoot subs. It was a lot of fun. Uh... Yeah, you just lock on and then shoot away. You have to have stay line of sight to be locked on though, so it it it, it takes a few it takes a few tries. But they you know they get down in one, so nice. And then see there's there's this area is filled with like gems and stuff. And like when I was a kid, I was like, dang, how do you get these gems? I want to get these gems because like you can't get it in the sub. You can blow up the the containers though, which is something that is recommended to do. But uh, if you noticed uh, when we were talking to that guy, there was a little power up that made you invincible, and there's one right there, actually too. And I just I don't know, it never clicked in my head that it was like, oh, you need to come in here as Spyro and use the power up to. Uh... He's gonna come out here to to get the gems. So yeah, it was. I was just an idiot as a kid. Sub driving skills. Why don't you have this here egg as a reward? If this here egg is a reward. <laughs> Ethel. I love the these guys' accent. They're really fun. Sweet. There's only uh, one egg to get. Well, I hate to ask your help again. Oh, okay, no. There'll be even more subs that don't come out of nowheres. If you could blast no them, I could use this acid lake as my swimming hole again. Are you are you are your skin impervious to acid? Get on, little dragon. Why do you guys need my help? If you're impervious to acid, surely you can take a freaking like Rhinoc hit. Like you have a submarine? Like why 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 are you outsourcing your problems to me, huh? You know? What are, such what are we? What was this? I mean, gosh. So now with round two, people are even more difficult to to get. Get him! There we go. Sweet. Some of them, I don't know. I, may, I could be wrong. When I was a kid, I remember this being way more difficult. It might, it might still be difficult. I guess because if you follow them through the tunnel, you're kind of just putting yourself at a disadvantage because they go faster than you. So you kind of have to use, you know, your they, you know, they go the same path every time. You have to use your advantage of you can go anywhere you want to kill them so like you know he's gonna go through there and he'll come out over here i can just sit here and wait for him and then chase him out oh he's got he's got he's all wiggly he's doing fancy maneuvers there he's 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 a pro all right what's the other one i hear him is that my sub i hear is that my sub i hear that might be my sub oh there he is yeah that was my sub i heard it's gonna come out here none of them shoot back which is interesting i'm surprised that wasn't a thing the developers oh what what the heck happened? Oh, okay, that was... I'm surprised that wasn't a thing the developers added in was like, you know, them shooting back because it would just... It seems like that would just make sense. At last, the acid lake is safe for swimming again. Bought my microphone, sorry. I wish I could reward you better, but all I got left is this here other egg. <laughs> Maybe there'll be something better in this one. Uh, the wonderful life of a baby dragon isn't good enough? God, how, how dare you? How dare you? You know, I'm here saving lives and you're over here swimming in acid like what do you what do you want so yeah then we uh then we go in here and we go get all the gems and then we fly through here anytime we need a refresh so we gotta definitely keep an eye on that bar on the right side as we go in here and go to gems because this is deadly deadly acid that apparently a man with a pickaxe and some glasses can swim through fine but a fire breathing charging dragon it can't so you know that makes total sense I wonder what happens if you run out of time. Like, I don't know. 
the, do, do I die immediately or do I get some sparks hits in? Can sparks can sparks tank my acid hits? Is that a thing? Can I use sparks in here? Oh, good, I can. I was I got I got nervous. I was like, I guess it is just the same as water. Where's he? Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. There's a whole ridge up here that all the gems are on. For sure, for sure. How you know Sparks is just in a little bubble. You know what I mean? Does he also get the invincibility power up? I mean, I guess he must, huh? I need to I need to bail. Wait, oh no, where is it? Where is it? It's around here. No, go get it. I'm gonna die. We got our answer. Do I need to start that over? I need to start that over, don't I? Did I get any of the gems? Oh cool, okay. I guess. Huh. I guess, uh, because it's weird, because it's like, you know, they do that whole thing like, oh, if you go here, Zoe zaps you, and like, that's a save point, or a checkpoint, or whatever. But it seems like any time you die, I don't know. I, I totally went the long way to getting that. <laughs> it was right there. I guess, it, I guess there's really no penalty to dying. It didn't even reset. Like, but it's weird, because some levels, it does reset gems and stuff. Hold on. I'm just going to refresh now, since it's right here. It's always a good thing to do, is just refresh as much as often, and then... Go get a new section because I saw gems in this tunnel. So grab these ones. All right, what, what, what else are we missing? Anything in here? No. I believe I shot all the stuff. Where's the exit? It's right here. All right, Sparks, what do we got? Anything? No, you're pointing to the exit? I'll just go over here and hit them again just so confirm. Yeah, it looks like you're pointing towards the exit. Are we good? Yeah, I think we're good. All right, cool. Off to... Yeah, off to the next bonus world, I guess. Oh! Who put that acid there? Oh yeah, I died, so now all the enemies respawned. Anyway, uh, let's jump cut over to the skateboarding. Ah, yeah, crabs. We're, okay, we're at the skateboarding area now. So fun fact, um, if I actually came to this world before going to the ridged world, the charmed ridge, then um, I wouldn't be able to access this bonus level because hunter, this is a hunter thing. Oh wait. Oh shoot. Forgot. He is still locked up technically. I forgot that cutscene didn't wasn't Bianca breaking her out. <sighs> yeah, that's right. He is still trapped. We can't do this bonus world. There's not even, oh yeah, shoot. Oh wow. There's not even a skateboard spawn here because wow all right well never mind guys we're not doing the skateboarding world i'm sorry i this is a really fun skateboarding level and i guess i have to wait till we have hunter saved which means yeah you can't even jump up here all right well then um this world's probably done then for now how do you get to that all right, so there's not a skateboarding level to do because we need to wait for Hunter, but there is a mysterious ledge that I can, that I've been looking at lately. It's right there, over there between Spyro's horns. Um, it's got a little whirly thing in it. So like, that's gotta be a place to go where like gems are at, right? And like Sparks points over there. So I'm gonna try to figure that out for a bit while I'm here before I end the episode. Hmm. Oh, this is it. This is it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. It was the, uh, you had to go through the acid to get here. There's a snake. Chad. All right, well, I'm glad I figured that out. I was trying to think of a way to, like, glide to that ledge, and I was like, there's no possible way you can glide to there. So it had to have been, so they had to go somewhere else. So this is to exit, not to enter that little whirly thing. So, uh, cool. Anyway, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the, uh, in the next episode. Where, actually, hold on. Let's go back to the homeworld because there's probably a cutscene. Oh my god, I can never make that jump. It's so aggravating. Hmm, no cutscene. I thought there would have been one. Because I, be I believe we can now... We can now go to the next boss fight. Yeah, it's ready to go. All right. Uh, well, I will see you guys in the next episode. We'll probably be doing the speedway for this world before going to that boss fight. Uh, but peace out, guys.